Hey everyone, welcome to part 3 3 of my mini reveal repair I'm almost done I, I replaced the hinge pins and now it's just time to put the skid plates back so I will put the front and rear skid plate back so let's start with the front take a skid plate lay it down there push the arms and then click it in and should go over these hinge pins in the front right there and also in the back so just like that and now screw in this screw and if you don't have t-bone we screw in these four screws too and for the rear just take your skid plate and snap it on go over these hinge pins in the back and push it on and now when that's done it's time to mount the t-bone so to mount the t-bone the first thing we are going to do is to take these four spacers which are marked with a purple stripe and put them straight in these four holes so just like that so next step take your t-bone skid plate and the four long screws and put in put them all in like this so when that's done hold your take your t-bone and hold it like this and slide the screws in the spacers just like that so now it's time to tighten down these four screws a little bit. For that I use this little drill because after screwing in 12 screws manually your hands will hurt. So now insert the front four screws which are the shortest ones you get in the kit. Do not tighten these screws yet, we'll do that later. Also insert the screws for the rear. The shortest ones you get in the kit go there and the other screws go there now it's time to tighten down all the screws starting with the front one and moving backwards so now T-bone is on so now it's time to put on the tires so the wheels have been put on and now if you want you can adjust your turnbuckles and pivot balls to adjust the toe in and out and also the camber so this upgrade slash repair is done now I'm finally able to drive my mini Erevo again I will enjoy it so hopefully catch you next time